so about 12 weeks on the road now and I've actually talked to people and they say Michael how do you travel so much for so free um how are you able to do all this for so long well you know what first thing is I sleep in my car 90% of the time so here I'm gonna show you and check it out because I was talking to a friend pipe and he's like what you sleep in your car how does that look like and I'm like well it looks like this Guitar gets the front seat, of course, when we sleep because, you know, it's super important. You got your sleeping bag and then the mask and then you just cover up the windows like so. You can open and shut them and then basically you just make a little bed. Boom. In your front seat. And that right there is how you sleep at rest stops and save lots of money. Right now I'm outside of New Orleans and one of the coolest things is this rest stop is actually really awesome. But then, cause then you're just like, boom, just wake up in the morning and it's basically a camping, look at this. I love these trees. Look at this, this is so cool. This little like, yeah, boom. It's basically camping, there you go. Now I have a whole nature trail over there to go look at and um, I'm out in Mississippi right now, I, and I'm basically gonna head over into New Orleans um, and stay there for a couple of days. I was there the other day, and but I left, and I'm going back because New Orleans is really freaking awesome. But I mean, like, look at this. The hardest thing about car camping and doing a tour and being on the road for what, like? what, three months now, 16 weeks or something, is definitely not being able to shower. So my number one trick is I know friends and family that who have houses <laughs> or apartments. And when I'm in those areas, I just hit them up and I ask if I can hang out and take a shower. And all my friends are super cool and they always let me take showers. So that's the only hardest thing really. Uh, and then every now and then you can maybe rent a hotel, but I mean, Seriously, I would probably get a hotel like twice a month, if that, because, I mean, I really like just being in nature. Look at this. Out on the bayou, out on the bayou, out on the bayou. Here's one more shot. I mean, this rest area is definitely one of the best because look, they have their own little individual parking spots. <laughs> And then you have your own little benches and it's like your bait. I mean, this, this rest area is one of my favorites in Mississippi outside of Goddard, Mississippi, I think is how you pronounce it. And um, it's probably has to be one of my favorites so far. Not because the amenities are great or anything, but just because you get this nature. I mean, you're parked here and you're just like, boom, in it. look at this. What is this over here? Let's go see. All right, it came down a little bit. Yeah, it's like a river or a little lake. Um, this is where I have to buy you. So I've already found turtles, but I haven't seen an alligator. I really, really want to see an alligator before I leave the Gulf Coast, but I don't know. We shall see. Well, there you go. That was my tour of the rest stop in Goddard, Mississippi. And just a little idea about awesome car camping, how easy it is and how you can travel America, go on road trips, do whatever you want, camp in your car, and it's basically a fraction of the money and stay at rest stops so you don't have to get hotels. But I was looking at a calendar and I'm looking at the map and I'm like, oh man, I've actually driven I think I'm about 18,000 miles in total in the past three months. It's been wild. Um, I think I played now in 39, almost four, I think almost about 40, 41 states. Um, it's It's been a trip, but I, I was looking at a calendar and seeing the dates and I'm like, man, I, I gotta get up to Seattle soon. and. I was just thinking, I'm like, it's kind of wrapping up. This whole adventure is kind of wrapping up. I saw a few more weeks, but the majority of it is tailing up and 
it's been a really fun trip and I'm excited to see what the rest of the journey takes me but it has been a long trip it has been really long but I've been enjoying it and I thought I'd just do another little update so here you go from Goddard Mississippi peace out